Hi guys, a new cheer pool has been released over the last couple of weeks called Blue Pool. What differentiates this new pool from H Pool is that with Blue Pool you have two options. First, you can create new plots specifically for Blue Pool, and by doing this, it means that you don't need to provide your private keywords. Or, with a new client released a couple of days ago, you also have the option now of adding your existing plots, but this means that you would have to provide your keywords. The original Blue Pool mining client was open source, with the source code available on GitHub for anyone to download. But since the update to allow existing plots to be used, the new version is closed source, which Blue Pool says is a security measure to prevent double farming. The advantage of creating new plots is that as well as not requiring your keywords, you can carry on farming your existing plots in the official Chia app or on HPool while farming your new plots with Blue Pool at the same time. Since the Blue Pool software is just a harvester, it doesn't require running a full node and so uses much fewer system resources than the full Chia app. Another difference from HPool is that there's currently no withdrawal limit on Blue Pool. I was able to withdraw my first reward of 0.00029 Chia that I got with just 4 plots, and it was in my wallet in a matter of minutes. This makes it a lot more friendly towards the smaller farmers. There's a pool fee of 2% when using the Blue Pool protocol, and when the official Chia pooling protocol is finally released, they intend to support that too, and the fee will be reduced to 1%. There are versions of the Blue Pool mining software for both macOS and Windows. I'll be using macOS in this video, but the procedure for Windows is virtually the same. To get started, first you'll need to go to the Blue Pool website and download their farming app. On the front page of the bluepool.io website, click on the link for either macOS or Windows. If you see a notification from Safari asking if you want to allow downloads from bluepool.io, click allow and the file will be saved to your downloads folder. Open your downloads folder and double click on the DMG file to mount it. Then drag the icon into your applications folder. Open your applications folder and double click on the blue pool icon. The first time you run it you'll see a notification from macOS saying that the application was blocked because it's from an unidentified developer. To bypass this, click on Cancel, then open System Preferences, and click Security and Privacy. At the bottom where it says Blue Pool was blocked from use, click Open anyway, and then click Open. The Blue Pool app should launch, you'll see Connecting to Wallet for a while, and then you'll see the login screen. If this app seems familiar, it's because it's built on top of the official Cheer app. To be able to log in, first you'll need to register an account on the Blue Pool website. Go to bluepool.io and click on the register button. You'll be asked for your email address and password. Enter your email address in the first box and then choose a password of at least 10 characters and enter it into the two lower boxes. Then click register. Now you'll see a screen asking you to check your email for a six digit confirmation code. Open your email and look for an email from bluepool.io. If you can't see it in your inbox, check your spam folder as it may have gone in there. Type the six digits from the email into the boxes on the website and then click verify. This should bring you to your dashboard screen. Now you can switch back to the Blue Pool app, enter your email address and the password you chose when registering and click sign in. Once you've signed in, you can start plotting. Click Plot on the left, then click Add a Plot, then you can select your plot settings in the exact same way you would in the official Chia app. Once you have some working plots, you'll see your stats appear in the dashboard on the Blue Pool website, with the number of plots being farmed, the number of partial proofs submitted, and your earnings and withdrawals. If you want to add your existing plots, then you will have to provide your keywords. Unfortunately, there's just no way around it. You also need to make sure that you've removed the plots from the official Chia app or the HPool mining app before adding them to Blue Pool, as otherwise you'll end up being banned for double farming. To add existing plots to Blue Pool, click on the three dots next to the Add a Plot button and select Add Keys in the pop up menu. A screen will appear asking for your 24 word key phrase. To find these words, switch to the official Chia app. Click Keys on the left and then click on the eye icon next to where it says Private Key. You'll see your 24 words under Seed at the bottom of the window. You'll need to enter each of these words into the corresponding boxes in the Blue Pool app and then click on Save. 
Now you'll be able to add your old plots by clicking on the three dots again, selecting Add Plot Directory in the menu and browsing to the drive or folder containing the plots you want to add. Then click on Select Plot Directory and they'll be added to your farm. As always, it's never recommended to give out your private keys to anyone. So by far the preferred method of farming with Bluepool would be to create new plots. But the option to use your existing plots is there if you need it. Just be sure to exercise caution and make withdrawals to a different wallet, not the one you use to create the plots. Personally, I'm probably going to be keeping my existing plots with HPool, at least for the time being, and dedicating a couple of new drives to Bluepool for about 20 terabytes. If you do decide to join Bluepool, be sure to let me know of your experience with them down in the comments below. It seems to be growing very quickly, as there are only about 400 users when I joined a few days ago, and it's already up to over 2,700 at the time of recording this. That's it for this video, thanks for watching.